Hello everybody and welcome back to the Blue Snot Channel. Today, it's that time of the season again. It's the Kelly Glasgow at Stanford Stadium. It's the biggest game of the year for the Quakes and I am absolutely buzzing about this game. Obviously, the media has been hyping this game as one of the best Kelly Glasgow in years, but all I care in this game is to get all three points against LA and beat LA again at Stanford Stadium. So, let's see if we can do exactly that. Come and join me to Stanford Stadium to find out. So now I'm at the Stanford Premium Outlet, which is right next to the stadium. And I come to here because we still got two hours before the kickoff of this game. And I want to come here to grab a quick bite. And one thing I realized when I was riding the train here to Stanford is that I realized that we are actually not that far in terms of the top four spot in the Western Conference. Obviously, since Minnesota, of course, won today, now we're back down to seventh place. Although we do have a chance to, to get that sixth place bad if we do win against the Galaxy today but you know in terms of the top four spot I think we're only about four points behind the Galaxy and I know we're about two or three points behind FC Dallas but we have two games at hand however despite the fact that I know we are very close in terms of getting top four and potentially getting home field advantage in the playoffs you also got to understand that we are actually only five points away from going at the bottom of the Western Conference so yeah, the Western Conference is definitely very tight, which just makes this game even more important considering the fact that, you know, if we can win this game, we can go as high as fifth place in the standing. So, but yeah, we'll see how it's going to go. Right now, I'm actually just going to eat my quick bits before I'm going to head to the stadium. About a half hour before the beginning of this game and the teams have just been announced and unsurprisingly we're going with the same starting 11 that beat Houston to nothing and it's also worth noting that Salinas and Houston is back in the starting 11 after they've been out for the last couple of weeks and in terms of the prediction of this game well you know what the prediction is it's obviously gonna be a win we got to beat LA in this game anything but three points and I'll be very disappointed about this performance so yeah let's see how we're gonna do today I'm gonna say we're gonna win it and I'm gonna say it's gonna be a high scoring game just like last year where we're gonna win it by a final score of three to two so yeah let's see if we can do that come on you quakes let's go and beat LA Please stand and raise your star as we welcome to the field 
the referees for tonight's match, followed by the visiting LA Galaxy, and your San Jose Tommy. Nice. Oh! No! No pass. Oh! That's just why there. Good start from us. Come on, boys! We're going low here. Almost tricked in work. Yeah! Yes! Yes! Fuck off! Get in! One nothing place! Get in there! Yes! Come on, Erickson. Go on, Erickson. Got Espinosa. Here's Espinosa. Oh, no. Still with Espinosa. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. That ball was just intercepted in the middle. Here's Vaco. Please pass, Vaco. Please pass. Please pass. Please pass. Jesus Christ. Please pass, Vaco. Finally. Oh, no. That was a weak shot there from Erickson. Well, I thought Baco was not going to give it up since he took on like four defenders. Espinoza kind of misjudged it a little bit, but he's able to get there. Go on, Espinoza. Espinoza! Got to watch out for his lap time, too. Yep, there it is. Oh! oh! What a catch there. And it was lap time that heads it, and Vega. Did a nice shot hanging on to it. It wasn't hit with a lot of power, but man, that's a bit of a warning shot there. So it's halftime here at Stanford Stadium, and the Quakes have a one nothing lead over the Galaxy. And you know, it's been a pretty decent half from the Quakes. I think we could have been a little bit better with our final ball. Obviously, Vaco scored the only goal in this first half. Uh, scored 10 minutes into this first half, and the defense has been pretty good from us. We've been pretty much shutting down this Galaxy attack. Zlatan has been relatively quiet besides that one chance that he had from a corner where he headed right into Vegas. So more of that in the second half and we can get all three points against the Galaxy. And yeah, let's see how the second half is going to go. Oh, he's onside! No, Wanda was onside there and trying to hit it near the near post, but went wide there. Oh no, come on, please get back. Please get back. Oh no. It's going to go wide, but oh wow, that's a swing and a miss there from Slatan. That's a lucky break there. That is a very lucky break from us because... Nine out of ten times Latan's gonna hit that and score. Holy smoke, we got away with one there. Get it, oh my goodness. Oh, there we go. Wando. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Shoot, please. Erickson. It was offside. Oh no, it was offside. Oh no. I didn't get a good look because it was on the other end, but it was offside. Here's Vaco. Vaco. Come on! Vaco! Vaco! Oh nice back heel! Oh! Just over from Erickson.
Oh my god, come on! Nose right, we made a substitution here. SD Nose is coming out. Coming in is Shay Salinas. Number six. One comes in. Oh. oh no, it's over. Pass, please. Okay. Right side. Tommy, Tommy Thompson, Tommy Thompson, Tommy Thompson, Tommy Thompson, yeah! Free now! Deflected! Amen! Get them! All over! We're gonna win the Kelly Classico! And Stepper can't get them! Okay, Wando's coming off here. Let's see who's gonna, who's gonna replace. Usen, Usen's coming in here. Switching striker here. No. Oh, what a save there for Vega. Vega makes sure that this has got to be a clean sheet. Erickson. Oh, he's on side. Oh wait, no, but it's offside. It's offside. It's offside. Never mind though, it's still free nothing in this game. There it is! Full time! So just finish here at Stanford as the Quakes win another Cali class goal. This time they do it in convincing fashion by winning 3 nothing against the Galaxy. But let me tell you, in that second half, oh my goodness, I was literally about to go on life support with the way how we were just hanging on that first goal. And thank you, Shea Salinas, for scoring that second goal to let me breathe again because I just couldn't take anymore with the pressure that the Galaxy was putting in in the second half and I thought for sure that they were going to get the equalizer but once again our defense has just been amazing in this game even Vega in this game come up big a couple of times make a couple of big saves but yeah either way guys hope you guys enjoyed this video my voice is, is pretty much gone right now but hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do make sure you guys leave a like smash that subscribe button and yeah I will see you guys next time